Hey survivors, in this quick guide, we'll show you how to generate a map in 7 days to die. So, sorry, no, any normal game, you could just come in here, make a world, doesn't matter. We're gonna back out of that. What you're gonna do, go on the editing tools, random gen previewer. So, and this is pretty much where you're making a world biome. You can change the seed in to whatever you want. You see up at the top, it's changing what type of terrain it's generating. At the preview quality, this will change what you see on the map. That'll be over on the right hand side. I'm changing my towers, wilderness, POIs, rivers, craters, lakes, plains, hills, mountains, everything you want, you can adjust here. There are programs that allow you to use outside of the game, but that's a little more advanced. So we're just gonna do a few things here. Change this. Let's give it a lot of craters, a few rivers. No, yeah, a few rivers. Tons of wilderness POIs, many towns. World size is 8192. This goes up to 10,000 plus. Remember, the larger the world, the longer it's going to take to generate, depending on your computer. Let's check out what we get. All right, now we're back. You see on the right side, she's generating her world. Each of these giant sections are major cities. You right click inside of the frame, you can move around. Use WSAD to move inside the preview. Now it's slow at first, hold shift and you will move faster. This allows you to preview the frame before the world before you get into the game. That gives you an idea of what you might be into. A good overlook of the biomes. See so it's kind of going pretty weird section. So this wasn't a very good generation, but that's just an example. You can do whatever you want. You can do this however many times as you want. Once you're done, just press new game and you're good to go. If you found this helpful, check out the full tutorial library for more tips and tricks. And when you're ready to build your own world, pingplayers.com has your back for a reliable, easy to use server for survivors like you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let us know what other tutorials you'd like to see.